Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. In this tutorial, we are going to talk about how to start Timo dropshipping on Shopify. It's a full tutorial how you can do dropshipping from Timo on Shopify and most of the people are very confused when Timo has been removed from Shopify. You can now find that application in App Store of Shopify. That's why people are wondering how you can do that. Obviously, we are going with another way, with another approach to get Timu products on Shopify. And it's very simple if you follow every single step, if you follow every single thing which I'm going to do in this video. So, let's get started. First of all, what you're going to do, you just all need to open and log into your Shopify account. After that, make sure to open AliExpress and Timu as well. We are going to play around with AliExpress and we are going to import the same product we have on Timu and with that product we are going to ask AliExpress that do you have this product and once it's have it we are going to import that into Shopify. This is one way you can do this and it's very easy it's it might sound complicated but it's not it's very easy. There are some few things which you need to do before make sure to add this extension from Chrome Web Store as you can see AliExpress search by image and you get the idea why because we are going to search our product on Timo and after that we are going to search uh, through this uh, extension over here so this is one way we are going to do and uh, this is very easy so let's get started first of all obviously you need to do research what kind of product you are going to get from Timo so this is where I am right now and this is maybe yeah this is the home page and obviously you can go to the best sellers also and somewhere wherever you want to go but obviously I'm going with the recommended ones over here and uh, you can go any one of them and for now if I look from over here there are multiple products which you can choose from so for this tutorial I'm going with the random one like this one and if I open this in a new link tab so this is the one which I recently opened up in a new link tab and I think this looks good as well and it has variations also which we can add to our Shopify account right. So in my opinion this is one of the best thing out there which you can choose and this is the one which we are going to choose right. But how we can do it and how we are going to search this to buy this extension right. So most of the people go for the extension and click on that AliExpress search by image but don't do that. What we are going to do, we are going to click on right click on this image and you can see that over here search goods on AliExpress by this image. This will allow us and help us to get this image very efficiently in my opinion. So just click on this and it will do it work. Wait for a while and here we are. You can see we just needed only 2 or 3 seconds to get the product on AliExpress. You can also go for the eBay as well as you can see but obviously we are not going to talk about that. We can sort by orders and prices also but I'm going with the orders and let's see uh, what orders are above. I think this is only above over here. So I can go with this one right. We got the image on uh, AliExpress and I'm going with this one or this one. This might look similar to that. Let me open that image. Yes, this looks good. So I'm going with this one. So as you can see we got the same image and same product from Timu over here with different name and a different style over here. We have various uh, you know style and colors over here as well but how we are going to add this product in our Shopify this is one of the biggest question right. So we are going to go back to our Shopify click on add apps and after that click on Shopify app store. This would take us to the app store of uh, Shopify sorry and here we are going to add an application which is called DSER if you search this one you will see that over here as you can see AliExpress Dock Shipping it's a free plan available that means that it is free and it has a free plan once you open that click on install and it might ask you to connect through you know you will see that do you really need to connect these two applications or not and obviously you are going to click on install I mean you just need to wait for a while So once it's done, make sure to create your own DSS account. So once you create your account over here, 
obviously it's free as you can see but there are some premium plans also you can just go ahead and check it out the only bad thing in my opinion that free plan has is tracking they don't have any tracking for that and obviously product limit in my opinion they only allow us to add 3000 per account so make sure to go ahead and choose wise products so i'm going with this one and click on get started and you need to wait for a while once it's all load up and as you can see link to suppliers just click on this option once you click on this option this will pop up and click on login this will allow you to connect deezers and obviously aliexpress so you can add products right we can see how it looks like just click on login and you need to wait for a while once it's load up after that just click on access now you need to enter the email and obviously the password once you do that you will end up over here here you can see on the left side of the menu we have open orders and we have aliexpress and unmapped at the top we have import list this is where we will get our product so now what we are going to do we are going to go back to that product again let me close this one go back to that product and we are going to refresh this page but before you refresh that page make sure to add extension of dsrs also so it will allow us to add products from aliexpress so if i go back to that page let me open that page and as you can see if i refresh this page on the right side we have that option over here add to dsrs you will see at the top right corner we have aliexpress product import success once you do that what you are going to do we are going to go to that page again and you can open this page in shopify application also just go over here click on apps and click on open dsrs and it will take you to that page once you do that click on refresh so you will see import list on the left side and as you can see we have one product which we recently added just click on this option and we have that page over here now what we got the product now we are going to paste this to our shopify after that what you are going to do just click on this product obviously click on this edit product you can change the image you can do every single thing related to it this is all the same process with other drop shipping uh you know product details you want to add and obviously like i said this before we have variants also add the margin uh, whatever the margin you want to add add description description uh make sure to go with the original description so it will seem like this is your product and we have images over here and we have shopping info obviously over here but i'm not going to do that obviously this is very normal at price variants description images i'm not going to waste time over here just click on uh push to 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 store this is what i'm going to do and push to stores once you see something like this especially pushed one product just go back to shopify and as you can see i have already opened up and right now i don't have any product but if i refresh this page right now wait for a while and as you can see we got that product over here and obviously you can go ahead and play around with this if you want and you can just click on preview on online store yes you can see that over here and this is how you can add products from temu to shopify dropshipping i hope you like this video please subscribe bye bye and take care